Did you see the movie Gladiator? Wasn't that a great movie? It was kind of bloody. But it was a great story about a good guy. Now remember, <clears throat> the, the real gladiators back in the Roman Empire were mostly slaves. And none of them had had any training and did not know how to use a sword. Most of them, when they walked out into the arena the first time, it's the first time they ever had a sword in their hands. They were fodder for the killing machine in the arena. In 60 AD, the Emperor Nero had 10,000 people killed on one day in the Roman Colosseum. One day. Very bloody time. But there's a scene, this gladiator in the movie was different. He wasn't a slave. Who was the gladiator in the movie? What was his background? He was a Roman general. When he was, there's a scene in the movie where this gladiator walks out into the arena in Rome. He's got his shield in his left hand and his short sword in his right hand. And as he walked out into that arena, you knew he was going to win. Why? What did he have that none of his opponents had? Fourteen years of training. He knew how to use that shield. He knew how to use that sword. And when he walked out there, he was victorious. He won. Now, the reason I make a big issue of this metaphor the message, ladies and gentlemen, in the ancient arena in Rome is the identical message to the modern arena in the business world in Brazil, in America, in Japan. The message is the same. Listen to the message. Act or be acted upon. Act or be acted upon. In the ancient arena, if that gladiator didn't act, he was dead. A victory for the, <clears throat> the ancient gladiator was surviving one more day. What's the message in our modern business world? Act or be acted upon. That's why one of the seven habits is be proactive. That means act. Do something. That means you've got to have a clear vision of what you're doing. You've got to know what matters most to you and be doing something about it.